Diplomatic relations between the United States and Russia hit their lowest point for about 50 years last week. What happened was that the Russians had asked the United States government to send over a delegation of technology experts to talk to them about how to deploy the internet, how to make money from it, and so on. And we decided to send the actor, allegedly, Ashton Kutcher. You know, uh, for, uh, first of all, we, we made the, the movie for very little money. And one of the founders of Twitter. Now, like me, you may be wondering what Ashton's qualifications are. You know, uh, for uh, lecturing Russians about the internet, and it turns out that he is the most followed Twitterer on the planet, which by definition makes him the biggest you know, uh, on the planet as well. And then there's Jack Dorsey. Uh, according to the government spokesman from the United States who went with Jack, uh, he said, platforms like Twitter are more than just ways to make money. I'm paraphrasing, but actually they're ways to lose money, but you know, maybe I'm being picky. They're affecting the lives of people for better or for worse. Worse, in Twitter's case. As that realization takes hold, it's just a natural human thing. People want to steer it towards the good rather than the negative. Well, apart from the fact that that's not actually true, um, I find this whole incident deeply embarrassing at multiple different levels. We're asked as a technology leader to send experts about the internet. And we send these two guys. You know, uh, I mean, yes, it looks like they're uh, having a serious discussion about the internet, doesn't it? But it turns out that Ashton's actually saying, hey man, I'm really going to punk you on the plane on the way home. <laughs> and Jack Dorsey here, he's debating whether Mentos is still the fresh maker. Yes, ladies and gentlemen, that's your tax dollars at work flying Ashton and his chums over to Russia. You know, uh, and I have a suggestion. Until the United States government can actually work out who the real internet experts are, why don't we all just stay home a bit more and spend more time with our kids? It would be less embarrassing.